everybody welcome back to the brand new video finally i have found some tops chrome mega boxes i've been keeping my eye out for these at walmart for the, like the last three weeks and i came across a walmart today that looked like it had just been fully stocked in fact i have a separate video coming tomorrow at the walmart 200 dollars retail haul i had to do 200 dollars because as you know the prism blasters and chrome blasters those are like 35 dollars a piece so i wanted to you know open enough stuff so tomorrow's video we've got a walmart 200 dollars haul for you today we have these chrome mega boxes we also have a saturday showdown tonight for full cases up for grabs that's filling right now on patreon so let's take a look at the chrome mega boxes you already know all about chrome it's been out now for almost a month one of the uh, cool things about the Mega Boxes is you get 10 exclusive X Fractor parallels inside that you can only get in these Mega Boxes. So there it tells you it's the home of the rookie autograph. You get 10 packs, 50 total cards, 5 cards per pack. And here are all of the odds for those of you that like to read that and see what your chances are. And also the no purchase necessary information as well right there for you so let's go ahead and bring in our sponsor both boxes are going to go to jeremy jeremy thank you very much jeremy is one of our patreon members if you'd like to buy into any of our breaks or support the channel in general check us out on patreon it's four dollars and 99 cents per month and uh you can buy into our breaks there and i also have some exclusive content i've got a series that i'm working on called garage adventures i've put two of those videos up i've got another one that i'm going to be filming this weekend so I hope you'll check it out. There's a link down in the description to this video. Now let's get started. Jeremy, here we go. Only 100 cards in this video, but hopefully we get some good stuff in here. Love that Luis Roberts on the front of this box. As you know, he's been one of my favorite players for ever since he made his debut. Even before then, I was a big fan of Luis Robert. All right, inside there's our 10 packs. We'll pull those out. By the way... You might be thinking, what's the price point on this for these 50 cards? It was over $60 for a box of these. I believe it rang up at $59.98 or something like that. Maybe it was $57.98. But after tax, I, I remember thinking, wow, that's over $60 for that. Um, I feel like before these Chrome Mega Boxes weren't that much. Maybe they were $40. I can't remember, but I'll have to go back and look. So let's see what we can find today in our Megas. So we got Dylan Carlson rookie card. There's Gio Urshela, and there is an X-Fractor of Kevin Kiermaier. You can see the little X shape right there. Um, I'll tell you what, I'm probably it's going to be one of these in every single pack, which I guess is cool. Typically, these Chrome packs only have four cards per pack, but these have five because of the X-Fractor. Here comes our, our second one. It's going to be Corey Kluber in spot number two. Coming up next, we've got Vladdy. Oh, we've got a Vlad Jr. in the X-Fractor spot. That's a nice one right there. There's a Prism Refractor of Max Kepler and an X-Fractor of Vladdy Jr., one of my favorite players. He's been my favorite, one of my favorite players for a long time now, and I can't wait to see how many MVP votes he gets. This season is only uh, almost done. Only one week left in the MLB season. It ends next Sunday on October the 3rd. There's Spencer Howard. All teams play at 3.05, which is kind of a cool thing they instituted a few years ago just to make sure that, for example, if there was a team that needed a playoff spot and, and um, maybe they would watch the game before, and then depending on what happened in the game before, they would hold back certain players. Kind of like an unfair advantage for the uh, teams that played later in the day. There's another Kevin Kiermaier refractor. That was just a regular refractor and a U Darvish X fractor. I'd like to get out to one more game this year. I've only been to two, so we'll see what happens. There's Clayton Kershaw, Byron Bucks. We've got Garrett Cole, Prismic Power. We'll see if the Yankees get in. The, the Yankees are going to need Garrett Cole to step up. They're going to need everyone to step up as they're in the fight of their lives right now for that final wild card spot. Personally, I hope that Toronto gets it, but that's just because I love Bo Bichette and Vlad Jr. There's Sean Murphy and an X Fractor of Kwang Young Kim. So far, nothing crazy in this mega box we've got an austin riley there's salvi perez new single season record for home runs by catcher joe adele is a nice 186 and keston hira so there's 220 different uh, i guess it's 219 because one of the cards wasn't printed 220 different x fractures we can find we got a good one with vladdy let's see if we can find another one. Oh, there's another vladdy refractor nice a regular refractor of vladdy and a jackie bradley jr for a split second i was hoping that was going to be bobby dalbeck but 
JBJ. Hey, Key Brian Hayes. Okay, so now we have a really good one. I was just kind of um, alluding to the point that I was hoping we could find one of the top rookies in this class, and we have one right here. Key Brian Hayes, X Fractor, the final card of the box, ends up being the best card of the box. Love that one for you, Jeremy. Congratulations on that. We've got a whole second box to do. Let's see what we can find in here. No autograph in that first box. But I'm hoping that at least this video will kind of give you an idea of what to expect out of these Megas because um, I was surprised I even found a fully stocked Walmart. So in the back of my mind, I'm thinking, are people just not buying cards anymore? Like, why are all these sitting here? Typically, Walmarts around this area stock on Thursdays or Fridays. So I thought uh, for sure that I wouldn't really even find anything. I just uh, figured I'd go and check and lo and behold... That was a big score in terms of, uh, you know, 2021. Here's Jeremy's second box. I bought two because I thought that that would be a better sample size than just one. Nothing crazy in that first pack of box two. There's Lucas Giolito, Anderson Tejeda. We've got a Giolito Refractor and Corey Seager X-Fractor. All about the X-Fractors with the Mega Boxes. If you are a Refractor collector, you'd probably want to grab one of these. There's Key Brian Hayes' regular base rookie card. we got a Prismic Power card coming up of Anthony Rendon. I just found a whole bunch of his first Bowman cards today. I was cleaning up my dining room a little bit, and uh, I bought some eBay purchases and put them on the hutch there like a year ago. And uh, there was a big Anthony Rendon purchase, maybe about 20 of his first Bowmans, and probably about 30 of uh glaber torres rookie cards in there bought a whole lot of his that turned out to be a bad investment but i also found a whole bunch of vlad jr bowman chrome rookies from 2019 i was super stoked about that so kind of cool finding some of those next up we've got adonis medina there's isaac paredes here comes the next fractor after the tatis it is going to be a rookie card of alejandro kirk so that's not too bad like the rookies in the x fractor format so far that key brian hayes that's gonna to be tough to beat also found aloy jimenez a little jewel case of rookies that i bought of his as well like a year or two ago there's his x fractor aloy jimenez i'll tell you what if I had to list my top 20 favorite players, Halo Jimenez would be there somewhere along that list. I don't know if you make my top 10, but top 20 for sure. Shohei Otani. There's Shane Bieber. We've got Vlad Jr., who's definitely top five for me. And Tim Anderson, a very good player right there, X-Fractor. We're down to just three packs left in this video. I hope that you all hit that thumbs up button for me. And if you're new here, I hope that you will investigate down below and find that red subscribe button and hit that subscribe button. And also there's a little bell next to it that some people just always just don't even know what it is and don't think twice about. But if you tap that bell and select all, it turns on post notifications so that whenever I post a video like this one or go live, which like I will tonight and tomorrow, you'll get notified via the YouTube app. There's Austin Riley. He's Probably going to get over 100 RBIs this year. I think he's at 95 as of like a day or two ago. Having a great season. Michael Conforto. I'm thinking tomorrow's going to be uh, our second baseball card auction. So we did one last week. And um, I had fun doing it. Had fun doing giveaways. And I think we're going to run another one tomorrow. So make sure you tune in for that. And I think we may have a Joe Adele here at the back. Oh, they got a, a, a prism. And there it is. Joe Adele. So how about that? I don't know if that was done on purpose by Tomps, like saving the very last card in each pack to be like one stellar rookie. Joe Adele and Key Brian Hayes are, I mean, on anyone's list, they're definitely top 10 rookies in this year's class. Neither one has really done what was expected of them this year, but they both have a ton of potential. So that's two pretty awesome cards right there for Jeremy. No autographs, but um, I didn't really read too closely the odds because those take forever to find uh, the autos and all that text so um open 20 packs got 20 x fractors and if you'd like to check those out they are on sale at walmart for 62 dollars give or take after tax so we will be back here later tonight with a saturday showdown of bowman chrome it'll be a fun one four cases so a nice long saturday showdown we'll have one winner per case and uh, also tomorrow we'll have the Walmart video for you and also an auction. So stay tuned for it all. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you all later. Good night, everybody.